What is happening guys? Cowboy here. Welcome back. Heading on up into the hills to find the Spartan traders. I'm guessing it's going to be here. Because, I mean, it looked like a marble quarry, even if it doesn't have a mark on it. Nope, no, it's definitely it. Now that I'm getting closer, we got a uh, question mark showing up. I would bet money this is it. Yep. There we go. Oh boy. Oh boy. A lot of uh a lot of lads around here. Captives, there's a treasure I'm missing. Nope, never mind, it's marked. I'm like, who is that horse that just showed up? I need to take down their commander. The weapons have to be here somewhere. There's only one spart in here that I need to kill. It'll be easier if I don't alert the others. I really need to get critical assassination. Chain assassination combo! That was really cool. How I went, hit him, and then teleported, or hit him, dashed to the second one, and then dashed back to the initial one. That's pretty fucking cool. And that's why that's the assassin ability. The one assassin ability I decided I would have in my warrior kit. Because you can do shit like that. Please, can someone get me out? Yeah, just relax. Calm down. You have offered me freedom. Thank you for your kindness. Are you good at all? No, nope, not really. You're kinda useless. I'm like, who is that? Somebody just shot Jeff in the face! I'll still find I found him! Attack almost never connects. Jesus Christ, I've lit half the camp on fire. <laughs> no, 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 oh, this guy's funny. Burn out then. Oh, uppity with me. Well, that's right, I had new gauntlets to put on from before, didn't I? Oh, they're 35. Well, are these good? Warrior ranged melee? Sure. Really do need to place a weapon. I need to upgrade you. Ugh, I could use spear for a bit. Warrior damage crit? It's not bad. I'm just the overpower warrior, but I don't use poison at all. That's not true. I guess my bull. All clues discovered. What? For who? Cosmos fights for Athens, and so Athens fights for Cosmos. Who? Who? Who are you? Okay, I don't even know who the hell you are, but yeah, sure, I'll I'll kill you in a bit. It's 
why that ability is fun. One down, four to go. That's also way, way cooler than the stupid critical assassination. See, look at that, how that, we got that, got back that, uh, that dot, that's exactly why you take that, uh, perk from the hunter tree, or shit refills. Three weapon racks destroyed, won't take much longer. One thing that might not work. <laughs> All right, and we're still only like seven minutes in. So, ooh, let me get this because I'm over here. Then we're gonna hop back over to town, talk to the kings, tell them we've taken care of the problem, get them to make up with Mata. And uh, unseat the false king. I do want to upgrade my sword. Like, the daggers, I mean, I don't know. The sword and daggers grown on me, but I'm still a much bigger fan of uh, the, the sword, the sword and like spear in the offhand play style. It's just, I don't know. I like the moveset a lot more. I'll, have to, I'll check with a blacksmith once I get back to town, see how much. Because the sword, I think my sword was 27 and I'm 34. That's almost 10 levels. So if I upgrade the sword now, um, I'll probably upgrade it again around like 43. And then once, one last time when I get to 50. Unless I find a better sword than the fire one, but I really do like that. I know a lot of people have been talking about the, uh, there's a fire mace that's like literally a ball of fire trapped in a cage. Um, that I get from a mercenary later, and so that'll that'll probably end up getting used. I mean, that sounds pretty badass. Uh, but as for sword, I mean, I was using the, the Spartan Kick one, which is okay and all, but I think the uh, that one I got off the Merc that I have in my inventory right now is probably going to be better in the long run, uh, this thing. I mean, it's Warrior, it's Fire, and then it's Fire Damage and Build Up, so... I mean, for a build that's focused around fire, that's kind of ideal, you know? Because when that's maxed out, it would be we're looking at 30%-ish fire damage. Um, and then I can turn adrenaline per crit into whatever. Maybe I'll go damage from behind. I don't know. There's all kinds of things I could choose from. Uh, staffs. Staffs were so just oof. I haven't felt good at all. I don't, even, I don't think I've used a staff once to try out... Um, to try out the, uh, what's it called? The overpower attack with staffs. Let's see. 
Murder. Go over and see how much it would be to upgrade my sword. I'll use this staff just to check out the overpower attack. Landed about two inches from your face hitting the bottom of that water water reservoir. That's one thing I think that uh, Origins did really well. Be rock. That's the flower or something. Um, but the the staff gameplay in Origins I felt was a lot better. Refaced Zosimos. Okay. Yeah, I think, um, not a fan. I mean, I don't, I don't know. It's just something about the, the spin, spin. It's just, ah, uh, I don't know. don't like it at all. Hey, hey, are you bullying this guy? Huh? Being a dickhead? Huh? I just stole your barley and your drachma. What you get? What would you like? How expensive would it be? Oh, ooh. Basically, all of my, uh, all of my iron. Ten thousand drachma. Engrave the other stuff that I'm gonna be using for a bit. Uh, oh yeah, just put fire damage and build up on the bow. 100% damage and health for tame beast. These crit damage, elemental build up, and we have crit damage. Let's do crit chance. Armor, I like. chance again and uh, b -b 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 fire damage can sell off yeah. my thanks here
<clears throat> wish there was a way to just like mass break down. With every single one of these that I break down, I'm getting the materials I need to re engrave. Alright, everything. Well, once I equip that, everything will be engraved again. We're looking good. Bow's not going to get upgraded until I'm done with my ship. Alright, um, where do I have to go? I wanted to go... Bully the bullies. Alright, let's go talk to Marini. Got my sword again. Which is nice. I'll be good for another, uh... Five, six levels. <laughs> really want to use that, the ground slam. I haven't tried it yet. What is that? King of Sparta. King of Ma oh, that's just a, another quest I have. Well, let's do this one first, since it's a sub-quest. I, I don't know if it's like a sub-quest, but I mean it's you know bracketed under the other quest. Grandfather was a true hero. Maybe one day. They'll sculpt the statue of me. We get the news. Supply ship. Leonidas. He was Sparta's last true hero. We'd all be under the yoke of the Persian Empire if it wasn't for his courage. The same blood courses through your veins. So, our blood is the blood of kings. You are so much more than a mercenary. You carry the blood of heroes, blood of power. Remember what I told you? That people would try to take that power for themselves. And then you promised. I wouldn't let them. Hold out your spear. All of this talk of the Pythia, the Pythia, I do not care what she says. Enough! We have grown tired of your insolent tongue. Sparta will not go to war. The Pythia has spoken. Pythia says what you tell her to say. She has been your puppet for far too long. The time has come to cut her strings. Oh, Leonidas. The days of heroes are over. You think your blood makes you special? If we opened your veins, it would spill to the ground and disappear through the cracks. You are no one. You are more than welcome to find out. Your fate is sealed, son of the lion. Xerxes will unite us. He will bring order to chaos. Divide the Pythia and everyone you love. Everything you stand for will perish. Gather the men. My king? Xerxes wants Sparta. You have to go through me. Damn. Oh, was trying to give Xerxes Sparta. Incredible! Now, do you understand? What must I do? It's time we embrace our destiny, both of us. If we don't stop the cult before it's too late, 
then all Leonidas fought and died for was for nothing. Our bloodline has risen to those who would enslave us. It's time we rise again. Well, well, well. Mother and son united in Sparta at last. And look at you, a god and goddess among mortals. King Pavsanias, we're honored. I was sorry to hear about your father. Yes, our fathers would have been proud to see us here today. You remember Alexios, my king? Who could forget? The boy who died to save his sister. Such a tragedy. An innocent child put to death because of an ancient, merciless law. I killed an elder. Sparta didn't find that very innocent. Alexios! <sighs> In any case, Sparta was weakened by losing you. Losing you both. We're examples of why these laws must change. Oh, I agree. But King Archidamos, if he could carve Spartan law across the chest of every citizen, he would. Spartan laws destroyed my family. Spartan laws had me claw my way through the streets. We're here today because he defied those laws. He did, and he lost his head for it. But we're not here to talk about the dead, are we? We know Sparta reclaimed our house after what happened to my father in Megaris. We want it back. Mind your tongue, child. You may not live in Sparta anymore, but I'm still your king. We graciously request an audience with you and King Archidamos to discuss reinstating our citizenship and reclaiming our home. Of course. There is nothing I'd want more. Archidamos, however, still hasn't forgiven you for the whole... nose incident. What can we do to sway him? There's rumor of a Illot rebellion, and the Kreptia are stalking the flames. Savagely killing Illots, stealing livestock, and leaving corpses to rot in the streets. The Kreptia represents Sparta's ultimate achievement in military training. Their discipline and fearlessness make Sparta's army the most feared in the world. Once. But the Kryptia have become corrupt and bloodthirsty. And training boys to kill unarmed peasants is nothing to be proud of. Do you want your home back or not? Good. So the Illots will no longer support the senseless slaughtering of their people. And where would I start looking for these Kryptia? One can be found in the fort on Zarax Point. Another was assigned to guard the Spartan leader's house. The third is more elusive. He was last seen in one of the villages west of Hilot Hills. He's definitely the loudest of the three. If killing Kryptia will get our home back, I'll do it. Okay. Three. And one of them is right there, so I guess I could get started with this real fast. We're at 23 minutes, but... If Archilamos believes in the old ways... Won't killing his Kryptia create conflict between him and Posanias? I miss Kefalonia sometimes. Life was simple, even if Marcos was a bumbling idiot. <laughs> uh, right at the leader house. We'll knock this one guy out. The others are obviously farther out, but since this one's here, we'll knock him out uh, and then wrap up the episode there. Really don't want to deal with the bounty. Bounty hunters sniff you out like damn bloodhounds. Your house. Treasure Captain Enigmata Ostraka. They weren't marked. Mistakes have been made. Sparta! 
you say that, but I can. Ooh. Oh no. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Um. Out of my way! <laughs> Captain here. Well, see, I happen to be in the mood for some XP, which means you have to die, Hypenor. Oh man, send him fucking flying. Thanks for the loot, nerd. Quick 8,000 XP. Out of here. Oh, way out there. Oh, can go through the Limni Marsh. Probably pick up another fast travel. I think that's a good spot to wrap up. So, I can't imagine... Um, well, I don't know. The one is hiding and I need to draw him out. But, as long as that doesn't mean you know, doing multiple side quests like I had to do to reveal cultists, I have a feeling we can knock out both Bully the Bullies as well as uh, the Meeting of the Kings in the next episode tomorrow. Um... Also, bar me making some kind of mistake, I should have episodes up in the morning. I completely forgot to address that, but uh, with today's, like, well, with um, Tuesday's episodes, basically I just got so busy, um, you know, getting stuff prepped for the wedding that I completely forgot to hit that upload button. That obviously was not the case with today's episodes and should not be the case with tomorrow's episodes, but if an episode's a little bit late, that is why, um, you know, obviously with the wedding only a week away, we're in the final stretch, getting, you know, making sure everything with the vendors is squared away, everything with the venue is squared away, etc., etc. So, anyway, thanks for coming on by. I will catch y'all in the morning with more Odyssey. Gonna go ahead and ride my way on out there just to save some time on that episode, which seems like it's gonna involve climbing because this whole village just wraps around a mountainside. I suck having to build a village on the side of a mountain like this. Anyway, though, I will catch you all then, so make sure to stay tuned, and we'll see you then with more Odyssey.